How's it going Instacart shoppers? Today we have quite the experiment. We're gonna be seeing if the five star rating actually is as big of a deal as people make it to be. So basically the way we're gonna do this experiment, we're gonna have two Instacart shoppers parked side by side. So literally right at the same spot, same cell provider. The only thing that is different is one has a newer phone, but they're both iPhones, same cell spot. 4G, no 5G stuff. One person has a five star review and one person has 4.96 stars. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna go to the Costco drop and we're gonna record our screens side by side and then we're gonna be able to see who gets the drop first. We're gonna link it by swiping at the exact same time and coordinate it because apparently even though we're both on iPhones, our times aren't exactly synced up together like I thought they would be. So that didn't work. So I had to sync it up with us swiping at the same time at least like two or three times in a row. Then you guys will notice that our swiping is not in sync, but the video itself is still in true time. That just happens because sometimes like I would miss a swipe and it wouldn't refresh right and yeah. Hopefully that makes sense. Here it is, here is the truth. Do five star reviews matter? All right, so with the beauty of editing, they should be like over there or over there, something like that, and they are swiping. As you guys can see, right here in a moment, the five star does get batches first. So what this means is if you guys are getting bad reviews that this could actually be affecting you, especially at the Costco drop. Because the Costco drop, it is very important to have first access to the batches because everyone is fighting for the big one. This is why I'm pretty annoyed. I just recently got a one star review from a lady who apparently I gave her the wrong size air filter, even though Instacart, they literally showed me the wrong size. It's a whole ordeal. It's actually talked about in my last video if you're interested in that. But uh, those circumstances actually do hurt you. So if you're dealing with someone that you think might give you a bad review and you just started their, uh, their shopping, maybe just uh, cancel that order because those bad reviews apparently do hurt. As you guys could see, the 4.96 rating actually got the batches a bit slower. The other person was able to swipe the batch by time the 4.96 even saw it. And I know what you're thinking, like is really a second or two seconds that big of a deal? And as you guys could see here, it is because you might not even be seeing those big batches or if you do, they're already taken. So yeah, ratings do matter. Hopefully you guys enjoyed this experiment. I know it's kind of like a short video and not the norm, but yeah, I thought it was too good to pass up on. I am making a very special video coming up soon on how I got this channel monetized, or I should say we, and you guys got this channel monetized within like three months. Absolutely crazy. This channel is doing better than all my other channels right now and is literally performing better than my channel with 50,000 subscribers. You guys are crazy. Thank you guys so much. Stay tuned for that video. And if you guys haven't already, subscribe. Turn on those notifications so you guys are able to see whenever I upload videos like this. Anyways, good luck shopping. Hopefully you guys get some good batches tomorrow or today whenever you guys are watching this. And have a good one.